Hello, hello, we, well, I am checking out Coral Island today. I, I have a lot of thoughts on this game. I haven't played it at all. I've barely watched any of it, but I've read on like the Kickstarter and things. So I think what I'm going to do is dive into the game, get started, make my character and kind of talk about some of those things that I've heard, seen. Oh, it's just, I thought there'd be a cutscene. Never mind. Again, I literally haven't heard, like, I've watched a little bit, but not enough. I'm curious to know if this is actually decent. I feel like in games, it actually isn't terrible. In games, the body mass, like, edit is usually just very weird looking. But that doesn't actually seem too bad. Anyways, I'm playing on controller, by the way, because... I... Just prefer controller when I can. I don't think I've ever really... Even Stardew, I prefer controller. Let's see. What is the... That's the hair color. Okay. Whoa! There's way more hairstyles than I thought, you guys. Okay. Um. So anyways, with, with Coral Island, I almost said Stardew Valley. I had been refraining from getting it because I read a lot about the Kickstarter and its release and how most people say it released prematurely and that the story content isn't finished which i think's kind of crappy to be honest and again this is only things i've read this totally looks like beauty and the beast isn't that is bell is bell beauty and the beast or is that cinderella well, i don't remember it's been a while anyways look really cute um I just, like, don't think it was handled well and released prematurely based on everything I've read. That being said, I have big FOMO and wanted to play it really bad, so here we are. I did buy it on a sale, though. I thought that would be my best bet, so I'd been kind of waiting. Plus, uh, I don't know, though, when this video will come out. At the time of recording... The next update, the next big update, isn't out yet. And... I wanted to get this knowing that big update was going to come out because it's got a bunch of content that I was interested in. Like, I, I know there's mermaids in this game, or mermen, or merfolk. 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 That was a mouthful to try to say. Uh, in this game. And I know a lot more content, including, like, dating marrying them maybe is coming as part of that update and i know that was something that i think was supposed to be in the 1.0 release so i really like this hairstyle i think they're kind of cute it's either gonna be this so not this one um it's either gonna be this one or well what's this i didn't click on this oh no i don't like that one at least not for me it's not my type <laughs> um i saw one up here this is too flat, I think, for me. This one was pretty cute, and I don't even like pigtails that much. Again, when I say I don't like these hairstyles, it means on me. I don't do hairstyles like that. I don't do anything with my hair, to be honest. I just usually just wear it down. Um. Yeah, I think we're going to go that. Oh, I could have clicked R, and it would have changed it. Oh, okay, that's really nice. Oh, don't disregard my changes. Um. I wonder if, so sometimes with character creators, especially as of late, I've noticed when I get into a game, they end up being like a different shade due to lighting than what like I had intended. Wow. I might just grab my mouse for this. Yeah, they're in the eye. I'm not going to make you guys sit through that. Funny story, I used to not like pink, you guys, and then here I am. That's the same. Okay, but if I go a little... It's a little too peach. Okay. Yeah. I just started, a uh, Match hair. Perfect. I should have changed my... I'll probably leave it on the default, to be honest. I have... Yeah, I haven't seen anything, so this is all new to me. You guys are getting, like, some full 
character creator details. They don't feel similar to me, but they don't feel like some of these feel really varied. And then some of these I'm like, okay, that's, that's not, you know. Um, like I said, hopefully this isn't a case of like, they still keep the eyes very dark. I can't get them very bright as you guys can see. Despite the tint. There we go. I want kind of like that nice warm, like, what kind of green would you guys call this? A forest green? Let's look at those noses. Uh, where's my body? Uh, here, let's turn to this. This one's okay. Let's keep style five in mind. Style six. Style seven's okay. Oh, style eight's cute. Yeah, I like style eight immediately. Let's, let, I don't want to knock all the others, you know, out of the running. What's the difference? Oh, I see. It's the tip of the nose that's different. See? I was like... This one's cute too. I like the curvature here. Okay, yeah, let's go style six. Oh good, I was gonna see if... Oh good, it does... Why is it so pixelated? Let's see what we got and then we'll look at this. Style six. It was nice. Not a big fan of nine. One didn't have enough shape for me. Style six feels both like shapely, but also. Um. There we go. I don't know why. Look at the... It must be the 3D model. I hope it doesn't look like that in-game. Okay. Facial hair. I just want to see just for the funny. Aw, uh, yeah. I love in-game facial hairs. They crack me up. I was looking to see if any of them, like, looked like my husband. <laughs> oh. Not really. Honestly, this is like the closest we get right now. Anyways, no facial hair. I'm using the mouse now. I switched to the mouse just to do character customization here. Ooh, yeah. This kind of looks like my character on screen. Let's see. Yeah, we're going we're going that color. Uh Mellow Miss Mellow farm name. Sprout. <laughs> Is it? I wonder. Okay, it's so hard to know. I wish games gave an indicator, like name, like displayed what it would look like in game. Because sometimes games add farm at the end of it, right? And I'm like, is this one gonna add farm? I'll call it moonlight. See, are they gonna say moonlight farm? I don't know. You can change clothes and hairstyle later. Yes. Woohoo! We're off on our adventure into Coral Island. I actually created a character in less than 10 minutes. That's a record. You leave Pokio. I'm... <laughs> I love it. Uh, to start a new life on Coral Island. I'm guessing Pokio might be a play on Tokyo. Maybe. Maybe not. I know this is like an islander type. Like, this has a setting and I don't remember the setting. So it might not be. It just might be a, my head brain is like Tokyo. 
Could be Pokyo. Not Pokyo. Hello, Mello. Welcome back to Coral Island, your new home. It's been a long time, Mello. It's good to see you again. I can't remember the last time we had a visitor. <laughs> I trust you had a wonderful journey with Mr. Wataru? Wataru? Mr. Wataru? Yes. Uh... Uh, I'll just say sure. Great, I expected nothing less from Mr. Wataru. He's the best sailor you could ask for. Please, if I pronounce anything wrong, you can. I don't mind if people correct me, but please know that I am not mispronouncing things intentionally here. You must be quite tired from your journey. Let's head over to your new place. So I, I apologize, but... Yeah, you guys get it. You guys get it. We all mispronounce things. Alright, the floor's done. Oh my, what a coincidence. We've just finished patching things up here. Is this the new farmer? That's right, Mello. That's right, Mello. This is Dinda and Joko. They are the local carpenters. Nice to meet you, Mello. Hello, Mello. It's always exciting to welcome someone new to our little island. Indeed, Mello. This will be your new house. It's a bit run down, but... Ahem. Excuse me, Mayor Connor? Did you just say we did a poor job here? Eh, oh, no, I meant... <sighs> Don't worry, I'm just joking. Unfortunately, we could only patch up the roof so it doesn't leak and replace some of the rotten wood. If you want more of renovations, you can visit our shop in Hillside, or in house in Hillside, northeast of here. I'm not gonna remember that. Uh, we won't char charge you for it, but you'll need to gather the materials yourself. Once we restore the foundation, you can decorate the house the way you like. We place the complete instructions in your mailbox. Well then, it's about time we head home. See you both around. Take care, Mello, and good luck. Oh, that was nice of them. As you can see, the people are very excited to s that you're here. Doubly so for Sam. You should pay him a visit once you're more settled in. He's the owner of the general store in town. And that is the field where I'm guessing you'll spend most of your time. Wow, beautiful. Look at that field. Oh my gosh, it was huge. It's a bit messy, but I'm sure you'll take care of it in no time. Yeah, that's the reaction I've got. Double exclamation marks. Once you harvest your crops, you can put them here and anything else. Yep, typical, typical shipping bin. Normal farm sim. I'll be going so you can get some rest. Once you got... Oh, since you just got here, you probably haven't bought anything you need for farming yet. Here's a little something from the town to get you started. You received a watering can, axe, scythe, and some random seeds. If you need anything else, I'm at your disposal. Come to me with problems, questions, some mean sake. <laughs> Welcome home, Mello. Oh, I, I messed with the joystick, so that's why the hold for skip prompt came up. Oh, this is a lovely scene. New quest. Okay, so there is a quest menu. I actually really love the UI in this game. I have seen this. I think it's quite lovely. Uh, main... Okay. 
I do not wish for it to just like hop in though. That bothers me. Okay. Crafting. Let's see. In my backpack. Makeshift fence, gates, chest. Okay. Paths. There I am. Okay. This looks like it increases energy and health. Wow, they actually gave me a lot of seeds. Oh, this is a nice map. I wonder if people will show up on it. I want to know what's under my marker there. Okay. A relationship tree. Ooh, look at everyone. Okay. So, and then there's even a produce. Oh, so this is like a stat book. Okay, and then back to the main menu. Is this 6.10 a.m. or 6.10 in the evening? Looks like maybe sunset. To prepare your house, we'll need 50 wood and 20 stone. Oh, I got more mail. Oh, no, that was it. Okay. Perfect. Now let's... Okay, so I can just use LT and RT. Now how... Oh. To grow crops, start by clearing debris. Wow, thank you, game. Press X while equipping a scythe, pickaxe, or axe to clear debris. Okay. Hello, seeds. Uh, watering. Normal, normal farm stuff up till that point. I've maybe not needed the tutorial, but... I wonder if it's obvious or if there's a tool tip. I did not look at that before. I'll check it at another point. Oh, there is. It's right there. That's a hoe. I'm silly. That's an axe. Where's my stamina? Oh, I've got a lot of stamina. Okay. And it only takes like two or three away at a time. Oh good, this is way better than- I'm guessing this is going to be better than Stardew in that sense. Or mo- Oh, Geode! Okay. Seems like that's like really loud. Hopefully it's not. It doesn't really look too much like it, but... It feels a lot louder than the music, which I feel like should not be the case. You know what I mean? So, we'll find out, I guess. I'm glad that they give you quite a bit of storage to start off, too. Um, I need the scythe. I'm just gonna start real small here. Is this not? Oh, that's trash. Nope. Nope. Oh, I have a dash? Did it say how to pick up trash? Am I silly? Nope, I have no idea how to pick up the trash. At least I thought that was trash. Nope, okay, well, we'll start here until I figure that out a different day. I may have just missed in the tutorial. I'll go back and look later. I would like to meet some of the new, the townsfolk, because like I said, I've, I've seen some. I've just not seen a lot, you know? So, I'm assuming I can do a plot, like a 9 by 9 plot. I know there are some Harvest Moon games early on where you couldn't do that because you couldn't then walk to this uh, plot in the middle and to water it. I don't know if this one is like that, so I guess I'll find out. They did give me nine seeds of each. So I'm going to guess that I can now that I think about it. Deductive reasoning. I 
I love that it told me I cannot use it here when I can clearly see I can't. Okay. I was seeing if I held it if it did anything. Most farming games won't do that, though, until you upgrade your tool sets. Whoops. Also, I am not planning to make this a series. It was planning to be, like, a one and done. But if you guys are interested in seeing this grow as a series, please let me know. I'd be greatly appreciative of it. Whoops. Okay, so where do I fill up my water? Can I do it here? Okay. So, since it's not evening, or at least I assume it's not because it's not darker outside. We will... Where's the store? Oh, towny! That's what it was saying. Okay. So it does show people on the map. That's really good to know. Carpenter. A stranger. Does the quest say where the... Visit Sam's General Store. Oh my gosh, it's way over there. Okay, well, here we go. Is that any faster? Do I have a dashing limit? It seems like it doesn't just let me spam. Oh, it does. I hope I can collect the plants. Like, the reason I say that is, like, in Sandrock, for example, you can't touch the plants. It has good story reason. Who's this? Oh, it's Alice. Okay. I have seen photos of her. Is that... Is that you, Mello? Wow, I almost didn't recognize you in that getup. Oh, so you're the one moving into the lot, huh? That would explain the outfit. She's cute. Okay. Around we go. <gasps> Doggy! Spiker do. Hello. Oh, nice to meet you. My name's Everest. Eva for short. Woohoo! Meeting the townsfolk. Did I go the wrong way? I did. I mean, eventually I'm going to have to meet all the townsfolk eventually. Or eventually... Why did I say that twice? Hey, Mello, I knew you'd eventually make your way here. I wanted to personally introduce you to the owner of this store. This is Sam. He's been running the establishment for a while. Hello, Mello. It's a pleasure to meet you. Welcome to the general store. You'll find most of your farming needs here. Most of the seeds I sell are seasonal. Oh, seasonal though. It would do you good to keep this in mind. If you need help, just holler. I'll be by the cash register. Well, isn't this nice, Sam? You might finally put a dent in that seed stock of yours. He's not amused. Anyway, before you get going, Mello, you moving was quite unexpected. I'm sure a lot of people are anxious as well. More like curious. To see who the new farmer is. Why don't you go ahead and introduce yourself to the folks in town? Um? Oh, a new face. Feeling really good vibes from you, mate. Shop. Look at all these seeds. I'm just clearing out that new button because I can't stand it. I grew turnips. Turnips. I have. Oh, I do have money. Um. I don't know if this is like. I, yeah, I went broke buying seeds. Yeah, I did. All the money on seeds. I don't know if that's a good idea, but I love the farming in games, so. 
Ooh, new person. Hello. Uh, yes? I haven't seen you around here before. Are you new? No, no. Oh, so once you expired the dialogue, you can't talk to them again. Okay, that's good to know. Hi, doggy! Bun Bun! Oh, that's such a cute name for a dog. Errands. Ah, looking for one cauliflower. Well, I haven't met Jim yet, so... And what if it expires? I don't know if it has an expiration. Oh, hey! I have to say, you're not what I expected. Oh no, I didn't mean it in a bad way. I heard from the twins who run the inn that the new farmer moved in. I just thought, you know... Uh, never mind. He's so embarrassed, he's like, uh, I'm sorry. Kitty, oh my gosh, there's so many pets. Okay. Butter, oh, is there a town, town doctor? Hello, are you the town doctor? Well, hello to you. Uh, choo! Sorry, that was the worst fake sneeze I've ever done. Ugh, spring's not the best time to move here. By the way, I'm Char- Ah, uh, choo! Get it out, Charles. You'll get there eventually. Oh, you can buy animal medicine from him. Interesting. Is he a veterinarian or is he a doctor? Or is he both? Hi, kitty. I'm going in the salon. Oh, it's closed Mondays and Saturdays. Oh, for lease. Oh, I bet you something moves in there then. Socket and pan. Is everything closed on Mondays and Fridays? Uh, furniture store isn't. Uh, no talking to you? No talking to you. Yeah, oh my gosh, there's so much. Oh, and there's different styles? What? Okay, I actually didn't know this. That's kind of crazy. I knew there was some decorating, but I didn't know to what extent. That's pretty neat. Gives me Animal Crossing vibes with the themes. Oh, hello. Oh, hey, I didn't think, I don't think we've met. I'm going to ruin your name. I'm so sorry. Al Aliyah? Aliyah? Al Aliyah. We'll go with Aliyah. Aliyah? Aliyah? Maybe that's it. Whose house did I just like let myself visit? Ooh, I love the decor. No one's home though, so I'm just like creepily running around this house. Yep, I'm just running around some stranger's house. Sorry, I didn't know anyone was at home. Oh, construction. Oh, hey, what's up? What did she just say? Sorry about all the noise and dust. We can't really help it. Oh, that's what he can't hear because of the noise. That's so funny. I wonder what they're building. I like that the town feels very lived in so far. I bet you Mondays and Fridays. Nope, they're open. <gasps> Who's the blacksmith? Hello, I'm here to meet blacksmith. Oh, hi there. Oh, I've seen photos of you. My name is Raphael. Um, I'm one of the blacksmiths here in S Starlight Town. Oh, I thought it was called Coral Island. Is that- oh, it's probably an island and this is a town on the island? That makes sense. Shop. Ooh, okay, I can buy ore. Not that I should ever have to, I would think. But I'm guessing it costs. I don't have that money. That's unfortunate. Okay. Is there anyone else in here? I didn't know if this was like a case of like an assistant or something. Doesn't seem that way. Have I talked to you? Nope. 
uh, yes, may I help you? My name's Luke. Pleasure is mine. Oh, he went from, like, angry to interesting. Moving from to a small island from Pokyo is an odd choice. And why now? But I suppose everyone has their own reasons. Good luck with everything. He's like... Nice, not nice. <laughs> I mean, he wasn't necessarily rude. Um... Oh, I thought that water was moving uphill. Hello, kids. Valentina. Hello, Miss Mello. Nice to meet you. I'm Valentina. Um, yeah, it's really fun here. You get to fly kites and build snowmen in the winter. My name? Uh, my name- my name's Oliver. Why? Uh, yeah, this is a normal day on the island, I guess. Except now you're here. Oh, wow, lots of people over here. You must be Mellow, right? Damn, I wasn't expecting you to look like this. You're surprisingly cute. Okay, well, that's not terrible. I thought it was going to be an insult. <laughs> well, it's nice to finally meet you. My name's Paolo. Pablo. I don't know jack about farming, but hey. If you need help with tools, come by my shop north of town and we'll see what I can do. Ciao. Wait, so... But Raphael had tools. So what tools is Pablo helping with? So the rumors were true after all. Welcome to town. We got a new scientist in last month too. Can't remember his name though. Anyways, I hope you like it here. Hey you, is this our new neighbor? Making your way around town, huh? Have you been to the tavern yet? Frank is there all the time. Have you two met? Uh, no. Who's Frank? Oh, he's my husband. You know what? You should stop by the house sometime. Frank will cook us dinner. That sounds wonderful. Yeah, you can tell us your story. Well, that's so nice of her. Are you really the new person? Dan said you were a farmer. Is that right? What kind of farming tools do you have? Okay, hmm, I believe you. Why don't you look like a farmer, though? My uncle Surya is new, too. Just like you. Okay, no more talking to you. Uh, you're the new farmer who owns that lot? I used to play there with my friends. Can me and my friends still go to your farm and play in the mud? Aw. Uh, they lost their play spot. The heck is this? It's a school! Oh, there's someone in here. I'm assuming the teacher. My name is Randy. I'm an elementary school teacher. What did you say your name was? Oh, yes, Mello. It's nice to meet you. I won't lie. The arm threw me off for a split second, but that's pretty interesting. I wonder if we'll get to hear more on that story. Oh no, it's getting late already. Uh, that butterfly looks stuck. Oh. Oh, I can catch it, that's why. Just entering people's houses again. I didn't even knock. I just let myself in that kitchen is so cute. Oh, I want a big kitchen so bad. We So we live in like an apartment, right? And we have this like small kitchen. It, well, at least counter space wise, it's very small. And I have like really want big counter space. I like to cook and bake and things like that, but you can't cook and bake and things. Oh, you can, but it's just not as easy with a with a small kitchen, you know? Oh, same place. Okay, I just went in a circle there. Oh wait, what's this? Observatory. Is there another way down? Because it's getting late. Oh, I can't get that. Oh! Oh, there's someone up here. Hello. Uh, Mello. Did I say it right? I'm Waku. It's a pleasure to meet you. Dad told me about you. He's the one who brought you here on the chicken boat. Yep, the one with the hat. Did I hear a Pokyo accent? Oh, you are? Where in Pokyo are you from? Next to the thingy. Up the hill. 
or chill? Oh, there's bugs. That's what keeps sugaring. Yo, this house is so cool. Anyone in here? He said his dad was the boat driver, so I didn't know if it was just him or if his dad lived here too. Man, this house is massive. What the heck? Wait, who are you? Ooh, she's cool. They're cool. You're the new arrival, huh? Don't bother me and I won't bother you. Ha, <laughs> psych. You're in my way. No, seriously, you're in my way. Oh. Oh, wait, I'm not close. No. Mm, sorry, I'm gonna get out now. Well, at least they told me the truth, you know? Oh, perfect. The stairs go down. Why can't I harvest? Maybe I need this. Uh, oh, inventory full. Ha ha ha. Uh, where's my house? Is that my house? No. Is that my house? Oh, my house is way down there. Where do I need to go? Down, straight, you know, okay. What's this? Does this say anything? You don't understand what it says. Of course I don't. Can't harvest because my pockets are full. I feel like that is not the way. I don't know when I need to sleep. I also might change the time so it's not military time. Do I have anything I can sell? Just that, really. I don't know if I can sell trash. It'd be kind of funny, wouldn't it? They didn't tell me. I wonder if it'll give me some sort of alert. Potatoes. I was hitting the wrong button. Did I just yawn? That would be crazy if I did. I swore my character just yawned. See, I like to buy the expensive crops because usually, even though they're expensive, they sell for more. Well, I completely missed that. Okay, to the bed. Go to bed. Oh, the UI is so nice. Okay. I'm sucker for good UI, you guys. Hades got good UI. Baldur's... Not Baldur's Gate. Um, I mean, Baldur's Gate is okay, but it's a little convoluted. Uh... I was thinking Persona 5. This one. Oh, I like Apico's. Ah, the ba basic bag. That's five more compartments. For five dollars. Okay. We need to water our plants. One of the first things we're going to do is either if there's a sprinkler, we're going to acquire sprinklers. Or we're going to get a better watering can. More shops should be open today, which would give me easier access to, like, talk to more people. Ah, uh, yes, they're just telling me about the watering hole and filling up my watering can, because I happen to water out of water on the very last plant. I'm just going to fill it up so it's topped off. I know that seems ridiculous, but 
What's ridiculous is that I had the issue. What is that? I think those are just seeds. I totally thought for like a split second it was a moth. Yo, that was a lot of wood. Also, I go through stamina faster than I thought. I'm just getting all these big trees so I can see the crops. Because once these crops grow or I get something else to spend my money on. I love that sound. Um, I am so going to do something. What was I going to do? Um, let's see. It doesn't say... Do I have to ship them before it'll tell me how much they're worth? I'm curious to know if that is the case. Okay. Uh oops. There we go. I'm I like that it tells me where townsfolk are. Maybe if I work my way backwards. But a lot of them are over here. Closed. There's also a lot down there. I don't think we'll get to meet everyone in this video because this is a lot of people. I try to keep the videos that I record, not stream, under an hour long. The only exception is like roguelikes where like a run can take over an hour. Oh, there's like three people I haven't met over here. Hello? Hello, have I met you? And no, you look unfamiliar. Whoa, look who's finally here. The new farmer, right? I'm Frank. Folks at the tavern have been talking about you. You should stop by sometime. Ah, now I've met Frank. Can I talk to either of you? Hello. I don't think I've seen you before. Are you new in town? See you around. Well, at least you're friendly. Let's see, what do you got? Yo, desserts. Hello, can I talk to you? <gasps> How lovely to see a new face around here. You can call me Betty, dear. You're the first visitor we've had in a while. After the oil spill last year, tourists hardly come anymore. Oh. To craft items, press up on the inventory menu. Press LRT to go to the crafting menu. Select an item to view its required materials. With the necessary materials on hand, press A to craft. Once crafted, place the item in your backpack and enjoy. Okay. There's probably more people around here and I just missed them. Mm, there's someone over there. Is this a house, probably? I bet that's a house. Closed. Man, why is that exclamation question mark so big? Is that like an important stranger? Wait, it's literally gone. Oh, there's someone in the clinic and the salon. Let's check the salon then. How many people are in here? I guess it did say there was like 50 to meet. Oh, the new neighbor. So someone really was moving into town, huh? I didn't believe it until I saw you myself. I don't often go to parts of the island where your farm is. It was overgrown the last time I visited. Just a mess. How is it so far? Oh, I meant, how is it so far? Oh, she's asking, like, how is it do going? Okay. 
thought she meant like far away. Like, oh, how could I make that walk? I said there's one more. Oh, hello. I love your hair. Oh, mellow, as in mellow, mellow. It's nice to finally meet you. Farmer, cool. I'm one of the doctors here. I love it. I love her hair and her tattoos. They're cool. I like that there's some variety in the characters too. I feel like I feel like all the characters have felt a little different. I don't know where I'm walking to. There's one person in the lab. I've apparently met you. Ooh, hello, who are you? Oh, you're Mello. I've heard about you from my uncle, Joko, the carpenter. Tall mustache. Oh, actually, I just moved here last winter for work. No more conversation? Okay. Looks like he's studying the reefs. There's someone over there. Can I get to there from here? That is the question. To be or not to be? I do like that this place actually feels more lived in than other farm sims I've played. They're doing meditation? Yoga? Uh, you're the new farmer? Yes. I see. No offense, but you look like you've never held a tool in your life. Wow. Thanks, buddy. I don't know why Connor lets anyone move in. Our community is great just as it is. Dang. Jim's rough. Oh, that's why it was big. It was like because I was hovering over it. Well, I don't like Jim as of now. I mean, I kind of get it, but like, come on, Jim. <gasps> you said you're the new farmer, right? Huh. That explains the outfit. How cute. <sighs> Out of all the places you could go, why on earth would you move here? Very friendly, very friendly. Okay. <laughs> oh, ooh, is that a moth? Oh my gosh, it doesn't look like a butterfly, it looks like a moth. I love moths. Hello, I'm here to meet the locals. <gasps> Good day, stranger. Oh, you just moved into the new farm. Welcome to our community. My name is Anne. A quick word of advice from your new neighbor. Be patient, since last year those darn crops aren't growing like they used to. Oh, you're gonna be the new farmer, huh? What brings you out here then? By the way, you can call me Paul. Also guys, I'm doing these voices. Oh, the docu-series Friends with Lo Wildlife, yeah. My wife and I made that. I can't believe you know about it. Cool, cool, very cool. Um... Let's see what this is. I'm doing... Huh, there's like a flower in the center though. Do you guys see that? Can I get out there? Uh, I'm doing voices. I'm not gonna remember what any of these voices are, so keep that in mind. If we do turn this into a series. You wonder what these swirling flowers are? Okay, I don't know yet. Probably how I'm going to get to the merfolk is my guess. Okay. What's this? Another mystery rock. There's people over here. Can't go that way. Oh, I got it. Well, I can go up and around. Okay. 
up to you and then I'll hop skip to the other spot. Hold on, wait. Huh, Mello? I'm Dippa. Hi, Dippa. Oh, corporate employee. And now you're a farmer? What a twist. Yep, can you believe it? Corporate employee turned farmer. Oh, hey, it's nice to see you again. It'll be nice to have more farmers here. Being able to get the local produce will be a game changer. Apparently Suki knows me. I do not know them. Okay, so a couple strangers are over there. There's all the strangers down there. How far up am I? Makes sense, I think, to keep going left. Woo! The infamous run and slide technique. I don't know if it actually makes me faster. Hello! Oh, is that you, Taro? Oh, I haven't seen you before. Are you new here? One introduction, buddy. Thank you. Um, let's go back in here and say hi to was it Wak Waku? I don't remember if that's their name. Where the heck are you at in here? Oh, it doesn't show me. Nope. I wasn't trying to get in their room. It was an accident. Maybe they're in their room. No, I don't see them. Maybe they're not actually in here. Or I'm blind, that could be it. Maybe if they're in their room, I can't technically see in their room. Oh wait, oh wait, there's stairs, right? Wasn't there stairs back here? No, wrong house? That's a workout room. Well, I don't know where they're at. The other thing that could have happened is they literally left their house when I entered. I don't know. Or maybe that just shows who lives there, but they're not actually there. That could also be the case. I'm trying to see if I can see them on the map to prove that theory. But I don't. So maybe they are indeed in the house. What the heck? Okay, so we'll go over here. Shop? Nope, they're closed. There's someone over here. Did I miss them? Oh, oh, he's literally, oh wait, who's this? I don't think I've talked to you. Oh, you're moving fast. A new farmer in town? You moved here after the oil spill, huh? I'm Zara. See you around. Hello. Yeah, you're mellow. I heard about you. I heard you're looking for some fresh way from the city. Um. Oh, wait. I should go this way. Okay, I was about to say, can I get this way? Okay, I cannot walk through those. I was curious. Danger. You hear the clinking of swords inside. You wonder if there's some fighting going on. Well, I can't get inside, it looks like. Can I pin more quests? Home sweet home. Track. Cool, I can track up to two. So I just need more stone here and then I'll be good. Um, I thought I had a quest to... 
Meet people. Oh, maybe not. Well, here, I'll check the crafting. Oh, I don't have flour. That figures. Can I pick you up? No. Oh, there's someone down here, though. Oh, you look like a flower. Can I can I pick you up? I was seeing. I'm clicking the different direction keys. Oh, five of any flower. Oh shoot! I thought it was just one. I mean, that makes sense. That'd be five for a bouquet. They literally disappeared. Are you in the house? This would prove my theory with the question marks. Oh, wait, they're in there. Hello. Ah, call me Jack. Uh, I run the local ranch. Your lot has plenty of space to raise livestock. Maybe once you're settled, we can discuss raising animals. Oh, wait, you might have more to say. Having an our rancher could be good for the local economy. We might be able to make local cheese again. No local cheese? What a travesty. Oh, it got dark. Down and to the right. To the big building. And then to the right. Yeah, I don't know if we'll make this a series. What might happen, though, is by the time this video goes live, uh, I may have played some, and if that's the case, though, I could pick up from wherever I played. We'll see. I don't know. I'm very indecisive when it comes to series. I kind of just see how the first video goes. Sometimes, you know, like, people really like the series, and then sometimes they're like, nah, you know? Look, I made 16 bucks! Woohoo! Save. Okay. Anyways, I think that's going to be all for today's video, but thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you do want to see this as a series, let me know in the comments below. Um, and if you could, give it a thumbs up. And if you are not subscribed, consider subscribing to the channel. It's very helpful and I appreciate it greatly. Anyways, thank you all and bye bye